In tonight from St. Pete, two teens are safe after spending the day lost in a swamp. Police say the two walked into the mangroves northeast of Gandhi Boulevard at 9 this morning but could not find their way out. And just within the last couple of hours, rescue crews found them. Our Rebecca Medina was there when they came out and joins us live tonight. Rebecca. Good evening, Jameson. This is actually the entry point where those two men uh, went into. It, this was supposed to be a day of exploring. Uh, now, these are mangroves. It's pitch black in there uh, tonight. It's, it's very dark. It's very wet. It's full of bugs and snakes. Fish and Wildlife said this is where they would have been spending the night had they not been found. Dirty, sweaty, and looking exhausted. Aaron Smith in the black shirt and Norman Oropisa walked out of the mangroves near a St. Petersburg neighborhood after having been lost for nearly nine hours. You guys doing okay? Yeah, we're okay. Police say Smith called 911 and said he and his friend couldn't find their way back. Fish and Wildlife tried to get planes up, but bad weather delayed rescue efforts. With every minute counting, Fish and Wildlife sent two men in on foot. I think we stopped four or five times uh, on the way there before we even found them. Weather finally allowed planes up, and the rescuers in the mangroves found the young men. But with heavy brush and nightfall coming fast, choppers had to be sent up to light a path for the officers to guide the young men back. The trek took the rescuers two hours. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm ready for a beer. St. Petersburg police said Smith was known to explore and recently bought a machete and wanted to test it in the mangroves, leaving some to wonder if he'll try that again. Now, we are told that both of these guys suffered some minor bug bites and they suffered some bites from some hornets that they ran into in here, but they are expected to be absolutely okay. As for Fish and Wildlife officials, they told us tonight when you do things like this, that they wanted to remind people, you've got to let someone know where you're at and what time you're expected back so that they know to call for help if you don't get home on time. Reporting live in St. Petersburg, Rebecca Medina, ABC Action News.